A wise man once said, ask not what your country can do for you, but what you can do for your country. That call to action that rang true then rings true for us today. We as a country need to move away from a culture of consumption and self-centeredness towards a culture of putting service above self. Really, it's just about caring. And if we care about the future for ourselves and for our kids and for our families, then each of us has a responsibility to do our part to ensure that that future is a better one than the world that we live in today. This is why we're all here, honestly. This is why we're all here. And it's why, as we continue to move forward, doing less of the talking and screaming at each other, but instead actually reaching out, maybe to those who don't agree with us, who have a different idea about something, have a different background or different experience, just listening first. I've done this over and over and over again. I've talked with people who voted for Trump and we have some of them coming to our events. And just ask him why, you know, why, what is it? What motivated you? What are the issues that you care about? And in doing so, then you really get to hear, you know, you, you hear a lot of things about economic insecurity. You hear um, different fears coming from different places. Well, you know, at least he showed up. At least he showed up. At least he's paying attention. Hear a lot of frustration from people feeling like our whole political system has failed failed an entire generation of people. So once you actually listen, treat people with respect. Don't prejudge somebody just like you wouldn't want to be prejudged just because of where you come from or how you look or how you voted, right? Treat each other with respect so that we can live up to that ideal that President Kennedy laid out for us.